In this world, apocalypse has fallen. War, disease, and decimation led to a plague that cannot be defeated. A plague of zombies, the dead, risen from the afterlife. While the military attempts to grasp tightly to the ways of the past, others have begun to live by their own means in this new forsaken world. The remaining humans must unite together to fight off the infectious dead, and worse, the living. Welcome to Origin C. little supply run now just got a little bit of things and I'm meeting with the colonel as well Oof, that could have gone better yeah that could have gone a lot better although where has he been he's just been up in that tower all the time jeez talk about leadership complex or something uh anyway I don't have time to, to think about that okay let's think and I st let's think, what else do I need to? I got some supplies for now. Oh, and the discussion with the colonel and Leo. Made him, made him meet Leo. Whew, good thing I pulled him out of that, or otherwise we would have an ugly situation on hand. Okay, what else? What else? What else? What else? What else? Um, oh, yeah, right, 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 right. The lead that the detective gave me. <sighs> he really sent me on a wild goose chase and I'm starting to think that that was just a hoax and all that no no wait calm down calm down at the moment I don't trust him and all but neither of us have any reason to lie to each other if he really is as he says yes then I don't see why he would have a reason to lie to me or anything like that but where? But I've already checked three places that could have the f of train tracks and all that. <sighs> okay, I got a thing. Where else could I be? Maybe I should look at some of the files in my plane. Yeah, that should probably do it. And why do we have to keep these on up? At the moment, it just seems to be slowing down people more than it's actually helping up. And God forbid if there's uh, any freakers that gets in here, this is, then it's gonna be a nightmare of a thing. Though it would stop them, I guess. Uh, I just don't know. I just don't hope I have to run into more of those... What should I call them? Bulkers? Nah. Misfigures. No, that's would be a bit insulting to Marshy and the Misfit group. Uh, I'll... Now it's not the time for name calling anyway. Okay. Hey, let's see, so I should just go and get that file from my plane and see if I mess up with anything, yeah. Uh, at least uh, that shouldn't be hard, huh? That did not sound good. No! Wait, that sounded like... Marshy! <laughs> zombie in safe haven? No! <laughs> Oh, 
This isn't good. Uh, I underestimated how much he deteriorate and the effects that might cause. Uh, I better find them and sort it out. I knew there was something up with you. Nick, 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 stop! Calm down. He's not so bad. Watch, Richie, Richie, look at me. It's Zylo, your buddy. Look me in the eyes. Everything is okay. Just stay calm. He's a monster like the rest of them. We gotta get rid of him. No, no, he's not like the rest. He just needs brains. I don't know how much longer he can stay calm like this, so I, you need to help me. Help you? Step aside and let me put an end to this. What's going on? Richie? What's wrong with him? He's a monster, that's what. That's not true. When I met him, he was nice. Farm boy, help me deal with this and get them to step aside. Who is this? It's just a zombie, right? No, Brian. He's our friend. He's not just any zombie. He's still human. We have to help him. I mean, he could even be an answer to solving the outbreak. Can't afford to take away that chance, can we? He's right. If we can save him, we can save everyone. Wait, he's a zombie and a human? How is that possible? We're not sure, but we're never going to find out unless we help him. This isn't your decision. Step aside. Ooh, look at this cutie. How are you? Cookie, that's a zombie! Get out of the way! Nah, he's just so cute. Zombies inside the walls. Something must be up. You, you made it, this poor man! What is she going on about? Oh, don't worry about her. She just needs her meds. Thank you for the help. How did you get in? Look out! I knew something was up. Don't be so reckless next time, Colin. Just kill the stupid thing. Hey, I mean, it was kind of cool. I mean, losing your arm is pretty cool. This is kind of lame. Not the point, you guys. We clearly have a problem. We should find help. You can find help if you must. Colin, Sika, we should lay low. What's going on with you guys? Look, you really don't want to kill him. I mean, Nick, come on, you gotta see the merits in keeping him alive. This could be the next step in solving the entire outbreak. You could help make history. Zylo, I don't mean to rush you, but I think I'm starting to lose it. Lose it? What does that mean? Oh no. See? He's dangerous. Watch out, grenade! Uh, Ow! Uh, my eyes! Uh, oh, please don't bite my hand off! Uh, don't worry, guys, it'll, it'll wear off, but now he's got his brains, he should be all good. Uh, I do feel a lot better. Thanks, Inmo, you really saved me this time. Look, he's fine. We need to figure out how that's possible to save everyone else. If brains are all he needs to say human, I'm sure I can help him out. Really? You do that? Absolutely. No, 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 no. I'm in charge of this situation, and it's too dangerous to keep him here. No, Nick, you're not in charge. You need to hear reason. Sometimes we just need to do crazy things like this to survive. You know that. 
what's going on over here? Uh, more and more people are gonna hear. Please, don't shoot that gun again. Gunshots? Something has to be happening with my patient. Huh? Gunfire? Let's go check it out. What's going on? I'm not sure, but I'm gonna find out. Now, Jax, I do want those shipments in tip-top shape when they arrive. What's that? Sounds like gunfire. Not inside my airport. Come with me. Please, Nick, listen to me. What was all that gunfire? What's happening? We heard it too. We came rushing over. I'm trying to figure that out too. I have the situation under control. What's going on in here? Oh no. Sir, as I thought, the detective was shady. He's a zombie. A zombie? He does look dead. But why is he still alive? Because I'm also human. Impossible. You're either a monster or you're not. Considering how you look, I'd go with a monster. No, he's good. He's human, and he's the last bit of hope we have. Hope is for suckers. Step aside, all of you, and let me end this. Hey, Colonel, you have a good point, but you're gonna need to think about this. He could be the key we've been looking for to put an end to this whole apocalypse. Safety for all. We can't just kill him. We need him. Will, are you a doctor? Are you a scientist? Well, no. Then keep it quiet. He might not be, but I am a doctor. This isn't of your concern, Doc. Military business. You. You caused this. Trapping me? I told you it was a bad idea. <sighs> it seems you're right. Perhaps my methods were slightly unhinged and a bit impulsive. So why don't you allow him to come back with me and we could do it right this time? But you let it go if I agree to help. You're a danger to everything I've set up here. I can't leave you nor wander my airport when at any moment you could be a killing machine. I'm sorry, but this has to be the way. No, you can't kill him. I won't let you. Me neither. He's my friend as well. I'm gonna stand with the people of Safe Haven. Just like you, he's one of us. He understands me! He's smoking. We can't kill those like this. They're all we have to hold on to. I want to protect the future. I say we help the zombie. I see the good in him. And he's a good guy. Sorry, sir. And what about the rest of you? I could see the profit in keeping him around. Let him live. I mean, I don't live here, but I wouldn't kill him. It just doesn't seem right. Looks human enough to me. If it gives people hope, then sure, I'm for it. Even if he did try to eat me, his existence is hope. So you all will stand between me and him, huh? That's right. So stand aside and let him live. Fine. Whatever. Be careful though, Doc. He's dangerous. Sir, what are we doing? We're letting it be. For now. Thank you all. You saved my life today. And Doc, now that you're aware, I'm willing to work with you on finding this cure if it exists. But raw brain tastes disgusting, so I'm gonna go back to my plane and whip up a real meal. If anyone needs me, that's where I'll be. Thanks again, guys. I knew it, I knew it, he was when, when he seemed. A freaking hybrid experimental zombie thing? Mm. Human zombie, human zombie. How is that even possible? Kirk, must be something of his doing. Uh. 
He know if he knows more than he's letting on, I am gonna want some answers out of him. Him. Wait. Would that mean he would have lied about what he told me? Could. That would look like it. Ah, <sighs> what to do? What to do? Just leaving B. He. You saw him in there. He could have. He was about to kill her. <sighs> Thank God I stepped in in time, or well, the kid would have been uh, gone for good. She's the last person that needs to be ki killed in this world. <laughs> Actually, no one needs to be killed, but all those people. Oh, he's the last hope. Hope for us. He's the salvation. He's the blah, blah, blah. He like he, he's some sort of deity. They worship him. No, uh, no, 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 no. He is going to bring us nothing but trouble and trouble and more trouble. I know it. I can just feel it. I'm gonna... The Colonel may say we'll leave him alone, but I'm gonna make sh... But I'm gonna get some answers off him. I'm on my own accord. And one... But I should play my... But I should be careful for now. I'm already as bad... On the Colonel's bad side as it is. Yes. No need to. And if I get kicked out of here, I'm gonna lose that access to a lot of resources. Can't have that going for now. But why would the Colonel... But why would the colonel even want him to? Probably all those people. Eh, yeah, da, 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 da. Oh, he is. I'm gonna take care of him one way or another. Regardless, regardless. He really was. Does work for Kirk in some way with that manner. Manner. I should take a look at the data I already got to me. Ah, it's been a while since I've been here. Let's see. We got the good ammo crate. The paperwork. Where could he be hiding? I ain't no detective, and f but I'm not exactly gonna ask that detective for help. <laughs> uh, no, no. Train tracks, train tracks, warehouses. Uh, I wish I. Is there anything I have on that uh, that project that could have been going on? Think, Nick. Think. Train track and a warehouse. House. Train cart full of bodies. Cut up. Up. Uh. Wait a minute. This is just no. Train track, train track. No. No. This. Wait, that's it. Wait, what? That's it. That's it. Of course. If I don't mistake, of course. But those people right there, and following that, that means, of course, it must be that warehouse. Yeah, if the detective's clue is as good as it can be, that's where I must take a look. And if I'm lucky, I may get some answers there. Hopefully. Hmm. But if I, but it could get dangerous. I have to hack with it. I can't afford not to take that risk. Okay. Yoik! Ah. Getting a little bit rusty, but at least it's good. And now, I know exactly where I'm going. And if that detective lied about... But let's hope that what the detective told me was right, because if it isn't, he and I are going to have a friendly... Little chat.